Tonight, there's growing concern over a shortage of field workers, California wineries. The problem may be short-lived, though uh, reporter Elizabeth Kling shows us the high-tech solution that could change the $6 billion a year industry. California's wine industry is threatened by pests, drought, and wildfires. But now a lack of labor is creating another worry for farmers. It's a real challenge. Fewer workers are available at a time when vineyards are growing larger. Our estimate is like, uh, you know, we have uh, two-thirds uh, less people uh, working in, uh, you know, wine grapes now. So now more grape growers are turning to technology to harvest and maintain crops. The pressure is more intense than ever to... Uh, provide for more certainty through automation and uh, robotics. UC Davis researchers are leading the effort to automate vineyards with robots. They're uh, semi-autonomous. We will uh, set these things up and then a, a tractor driver uh, pulls the machine. There are even uh, tractors that can uh, drive themselves. Their study shows the technology has a higher upfront cost but becomes more economical after about two seasons. We're going from a uh, $1.20 to about a uh, uh, 12 to a uh, 22 cents uh, per volume. While the new technology reduces the need for more manual labor, it also creates new high wage jobs. You need uh, you know, very skilled uh, people to be able to operate these machines. And there's a surprising benefit. Research shows mechanically maintained crops come out tasting better. The vine is higher up off the ground, so it has better flavor, it has better color which winemakers desire. You'll get a, you know, deeper, uh, richer, uh, you know, sensation from these vines. A taste of new technology, giving growers a glimpse of future farming. Quality is uh, much, much better. Well, much of the mechanized equipment is produced right here in California at factories in Woodland and in Fresno.